This is a pattern for a lace pattern called Fallen Leaves. Knit one, knit two together, knit two, yarn forward, knit three, yarn forward. Hi, my name's Bridie Jackson and I'm the creative producer on the Close Knit Project with Museums Northumberland BAIT. And BAIT is actually part of the Creative People and Places Network, which is funded by Arts Council England. Through BAIT, we work in partnership with groups and organisations to create opportunities for people to shape and get involved in creative projects where they live. So Close Knit is one of two final commissions on the Museums Northumberland BAIT programme and for this we worked with a fantastic community decision making panel and with them we worked to create a brief for the project and then that same panel of people also helped us to shortlist and to finally recruit the amazing artists that we worked with on this project. When I started, I thought it was a great idea, but I was kind of nervous. But as the time like passed, it went great. Well, I was on the panel and I decided to pick Alison and Amanda for the project because I thought if they both have their own ideas and put them both together, it would make a big project that would be even better. I got involved in the project right at the very beginning because I did Toys in the Window at the start of lockdown. Then I got the chance of working with an artist and I said I'd like to work with Cheryl. I've been working with her ever since. Is this my chance of getting something where I can have my little characters move? I'm Cheryl Jenkins and I'm an animator. Um, I've been working with Museums Northumberland Bait for the past couple of years on the Close Knit project and I've been working mainly with the community and collaborating with various groups and the other artists, Amanda and Alison. Hello, my name is Amanda Looms. I'm an artist and filmmaker and I've been working on the soundtrack for Close Knit. I'm Alison Carlier and I'm an artist that often uses sound and music and I've been helping put the soundtrack together for Close Knit. So a really important part of the project is, was hearing first hand accounts of life in the North East. So we've been gathering stories across generations, different walks of life, and then finding some common ground and linking those up and using what people said to us in conversations to inform like the next questions that we ask. And then as part of that, we set a task for members of the community to start contributing their characters, their ideas. It grew in response to what people brought to the project. That was important. I've been going out and about collecting sounds from the local environment and I've been finding musicians who are kind of hidden in the community who might not ever realise were there, which has been amazing actually. <laughs> What's been really great on the project is just having so many people involved who've been so enthusiastic and brought so many different ideas. Seeing people trying new things and being creative and then just sharing it, even if it's just with your neighbours, and I think that goes all the way back to what Carol was doing in the first place, creating something that's shared with the rest of the community. met some amazing people. They've been incredibly generous with their time and their imaginations and we've gone on quite a journey together. I really enjoyed having teamwork and finding like learning new things, being creative and I loved how it turned out at the end because I think everyone worked so hard on it. Uh, being a part of like having the experience of like helping something big like this because it's yeah. My favourite part of working on this project has been getting out of my comfort zone, you know, trying new things, meeting new people. It's all been a great experience for us. Actually, through the course of the project, it's just it just feels really special. It feels like something like 
um, yeah, that we all can be proud of as a group of people and it's, it's actually belongs to all of us. I actually think we have formed our own little close-knit community around the making of this project. It makes me tingle just thinking about it. It's great to have been involved in.